one of the rarest habitats in Georgia, is underneath a power line. And I got to learn all about it from botanists at the State Botanical Garden of Georgia. We are standing in genuine Piedmont Prairie. It's phenomenal <laughs> habitat for diversity. It's the species, it's for nectaring, it's for brooding, it's for food, but it's also the structure. A whole world of critters that are living underneath this canopy of grasses. A lot of these spaces survive under power line rights of way, roadsides, and it's because of the mowing regime and keeping sunlight on the land. So the goal is to collect seeds from these remnant wild populations. Perfect. Farm them and get them back to restoration partners to increase habitat. To see what that looks like, let's head to the Mimsy Lanier Center for Native Plant Studies. It's really a fully adapted horticultural complex for growing native plants. Applying our scientific expertise and our horticultural expertise, really sleuthing through how plants like to grow. So when we make a seed collection, we take an herbarium voucher so that we always have a record of the plant associated with the seeds. And then we harvest seeds from the plant, clean them, get rid of the chaff, this is the end product, the actual seed. So once they're cleaned, they'll go into short-term storage, which is cold and dry, before being distributed to production partners. At the garden, we're committed to conserving native plants. Plants protect us. We're more resilient with native intact ecosystems. For the birds, for the wildlife, for the people, for the plants. <laughs> for the plants.